Hello, fellow YouTube Pipe Club members. This is Smarty's Bob, and we have moved to the garage. It's been a while since I've been on here. Been messing with a few things. Uh, don't have a tripod. Just got my phone setting back up on a prop. Thought I'd share a bowl with you. Got my corn cob <laughs> peanut pipe, <laughs> whatever you call it. I'm smoking some uh, tobacco that I keep in these containers. It's M&M's tobacco. <laughs> it's really not. It's uh, Lane's Limited, very cherry. <laughs> been a while since I've been with you thought I'd share a pipe with you so you can pause at any time go get your favorite tobacco light up with me going to try to use my one light light which by the way continues to work wonders I haven't been on for about a week but I want you to know I still enjoy the YouTube pipe community a lot been watching one member he was interviewed by Parsimonious Piper, who's a, got another great channel. Everybody ought to be on Parsimonious Piper. The guy he interviewed that interested me, and I get such a kick out of his uh, VRs, is Clay S. So if you haven't seen any of his, uh, I suggest you go to Clay S and watch some of his videos. Besides pipe smoking, he also has some cooking videos, and he's going to enter that cooking challenge. That Briar Blues has. <clears throat> Briar Blues is interesting. You ought to check his channels out. I'm not that good of a cook. I'm a better eater than I am a cooker. <laughs> I did go to NN's channel. He's got another uh, challenge out there. And he's an artist and quite a good artist, by the way. And he wants all of his people to enter his contest and draw a picture. Now I'm 75 years old and I got that CRS disease. Also, the older you get, the more you shake. As you've seen when I've tried to show you some of these pipes, they're not the steadiest. Sometimes I shake a little bit. It's called old age. It happens to some people at 85, others at 80, and some at 75. I'm going to be drawing a picture for ENN's contest and enter it, but it's going to be <laughs> it's going to be quite a picture. He's going to think a second grader drew it, but it's all right. I never thought myself as an artist, anyhow. It's a cool fall day out here. It did make it into the 50s, but it's spitting rain now and then, and uh, time to get off of that patio out and back. I'll move out there when it gets a little colder and the sun comes out and it warms it up back there. On cloudy days, the sun doesn't warm it up back there, but when we have a snowstorm and then the day or two afterwards it's bright and sunny, it's really warm out there. So.
you'll see me out there back in the snow sometimes. In the meantime, I moved my junk out here in the garage. Uh, not sure where I should do with it and put it all. I'd sure like to have some kind of area back over here. The garage is pretty big. You can't see it all. It's called a three-car garage, but you could get four or five in here. Wife don't want the garage to smell like an ashtray. <laughs> I told her, I says, I'll try to spray some stuff around and keep the pipes clean and the smell up, but uh, it may smell like an ashtray. The garage does stay warm even in the wintertime. We don't heat it out here, but the house is so well insulated that it hardly ever freezes out here unless it's really in the single digits and you open the garage doors and come and go then and get below 32 in here. Most of the time it's, it's above freezing in here. I'm really liking this one light thing. I don't, I know nobody does it. Everybody lights puts it out and lights it in. I light one time and it'll last. Once the ashes do get down a little bit, you just very, very lightly tap while puffing, fire starts right up. Just as good as you just lit. Well, it's a cool, cloudy day here in central Indiana. I hope it's warmer and sunnier where you are. But wherever you are, remember, yesterday was just a memory. Tomorrow's just a promise. So I want you to enjoy your today. <laughs>